Good afternoon. I'm going to start saying welcome to my DIW channel. It's doing it wrong um, because we have another repair today. This one has been driving me crazy probably for five, ten years, and I fixed it half a dozen times. The drawer that goes in my desk at work. Here it is. I mean, it's just, you know, one of those, the, they're not cheap. But look at my repairs over the years. I've duct taped it, put nails across it to try to keep it in. So this is in, the bottom is in the slot. This side is not in the slot, nor is the top. And you know what, it's broken. Let's see if I, well, there we go, I fixed that. But it's still, if I got a bracket to hold here and here, I think it would work, but I don't have one, which means a Home Depot trip, which is not going to happen today. I'm not going to do it today, <sighs> which means that what I'll have to do is leave that drawer right on the counter, right on the counter, making me crazy, so that I finish it. Otherwise, I'll put it away. It sat in my, the back seat of my car for three weeks. I just brought it in. Hi, good afternoon. It's a new day. Last night, I was getting ready to go to bed. And this just needed my attention, you know? It was gonna keep me awake. And I, what I ended up doing is taking out my liquid nails and doing the, all the edges all the way around. I went to Home Depot today. I swear to God I need stock in Home Depot. And I bought corner brackets. That might actually bring it together if I do this. Or it could break the whole thing. I'm going to do that. We'll find out in a minute if it was another smart move or a stupid move. Okay, it is Sunday afternoon here and it is so windy out, it's not things over in the yard. I keep thinking the roof is going to go because that would be the only other thing that hasn't happened recently. Um, it, it is just raw out. Do you know, I, I never realize how much extra crap I do all the time. And when you don't have money, you do what you got. At least that's how I always, always taught. Be semi-self-sufficient, I guess. It amazes me that they can't make these good enough that they don't fall apart right away. Now I sound like the old person, right? Like, in the old days! But the quality, doesn't it seem like the quality has really gone down? It makes me sad. Oh. I've been reading every single comment that people make on the channel and I appreciate... What the heck was that? I appreciate um, what I'm... everything I'm reading. It's amazing how, no matter how far apart we are, how much we're alike. That actually pulled it together a little. We may have, I may have, you just watched. I'm not giving you credit. I did the work. Uh, it may be in. Oh, that would be awesome. All right, I'm done. Another project. Okay, the other project that I started working on, and I thought I did such a good job, and I didn't. May I? What? So I thought I'd put these on the wall. First of all, I didn't bother getting out a level and this one goes downhill like this. This one is fine. And then I realized I could put one more, but this one just will not stick. And I actually put liquid nails because the adhesive was gone and it still won't stick. So I'm wondering if Velcro will do it or do I hit it with liquid nails one more time? Do we try Velcro? Let's just try Velcro first. What the heck? Velcro is super easy for us to do. Okay, now we take the other one part of the Velcro off. We take the other part of the Velcro off. Get. All right, and it should go right here. Am I going to measure it? Absolutely not. Why? I don't know. Well, tomorrow, I don't feel like doing anything today. The only reason I finished the drawer is because it was staring at me, which is why I left it out. I thought I was all done for the day, but 
my daily Amazon drop thing. I love Yankee Ingenuity. There were two screws in here on the, the thicker pieces of wood, and this wouldn't have fit. I would have had to put it on the skinny one, and I was so afraid the nails would, the screws would go right through the wood. So I just stretched this, and it's holding on, and I think it might work. I'll know that that was another mistake. <laughs> it just fell off. Yeah. Well, it's always worth a try. Shoot! Right. I'm putting the Velcro just uh, on the corner. Oh, maybe I should. Yeah, that was probably dumb. Yeah, that's how much it's going to hold. I want it right against the bottom, but I want. Oh, you son of a gun! You're going to go here. That way now. You're going to decide to play nicely. What do you, hey, now I wonder if it'd be thick enough for a screw. <laughs> I think it would. All right, let me see if that would work. Well, it's in the wood and it's holding and I didn't go too deep so it didn't go to the other side. But we may just have one another round and I'm speaking way too soon, aren't I? My, by George, I think we've got it. Oh, not yet. <laughs> yeah, open your mouth. Open your mouth. Every blooming time. I think it's gonna stay. Famous last words. Uh, this is crazy. I thought I was done. I did the draw. I did the spice cabinet, and then that Amazon order came in. And so finally, that's out of the cabinet, which is a really good thing. And then the other thing, those um, cereal containers that came in, I finally have my cereals out of the refrigerator, and they're in here. I also cut up potatoes and onions in the Instapot. I have meatloaf warming up. I'll actually have a meal. I don't understand what just happened. I just I just finished. I'm gonna just take a deep breath and enjoy it. It's very nice. Guys, have a great night. Thank you so much for watching. Please keep your comments coming. I really enjoy them and ideas. No R in ideas. Keep your ideas coming. This is so much fun for me. And I'm enjoying everything that you have to say. So I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.